Fans of the Green Lantern have been waiting a long time for a good live-action adaptation, and after a brief cameo in Justice League, that anticipation has only gotten bigger. And now, we're another step closer to seeing the DCEU's version come to life. With the restructuring of DC's film slate in 2017, some films found themselves moved down the list while others were mo removed completely. The Green Lantern Corps, however, made the cut and is slated for a 2020 release, and DC has already reserved two possible dates. February 14th, which is Valentine's Day, and my birthday, June 5th. Back in July, we reported that Rupert Wyatt was attached to direct, but as we all know, especially with the DC films, until a movie is in production, and even sometimes after, I'm looking at you, Justice League, I'm looking at you. Things are always in flux, and Rupert Wyatt is now out. Our source now tells us they're looking at Christopher McQuarrie to take the reins. McQuarrie's portfolio of action films has been growing over the past several years. He wrote the screenplay for The Edge of Tomorrow, and both wrote and directed Jack Reacher, Mission Impossible Rogue Nation, and the upcoming Mission Impossible Fallout. The character breakdowns we previously reported for Hal Jordan have not changed. The studio is still looking to cast an actor between the 39 and 50 age range, and there's only one actor that Macquarie has worked with that could fit the bill, Tom Cruise. He's a little out of the age range at 55, but think about it, Maverick becoming the Green Lantern? Does kind of make sense. Well, there's no deal in place, we can expect to see some movement on this project very soon. With the anticipated release being in 2020, and this more than likely being a very CGI heavy film, they're gonna need to get started sometime in the next few months. Now, what do you guys think about Christopher McQuarrie? He did a great job with Mission Impossible Rogue Nation, and what if he does team back up with Tom Cruise outside of the Mission Impossible franchise and inside the DCEU? Now I know what you're thinking, Tom Cruise? Well, he could be the perfect choice for this. He fits the age range in which the studio's looking for, and he's already played a pilot once. And with his Mission Impossible franchise, he has had success there, so maybe he can transition this and bring something to the DCEU. Who knows? But leave a message in the comments below. I'm Joe with That Hashtag Show. Thanks for watching, and please hit that like, share, and subscribe button to stay up to date with everything trending in geek pop culture.